Hello, I'm going to tie a number 14 red quill variation. Um, this is a soft tackle version of a classic Catskill dry fly called the red quill. And here's a number 14 light nymph hook in the vise. That's Danville Rusty Brown 6 out thread. The hackle and tail, part of the hackle, is going to be this is a uh, partridge feather from under the wing. And I've actually taken a Prismacolor marker and made it a little more yellow looking. So the fibers will be these base fibers here for the tail. I'm going to strip a few of those off. The tail will be the same length as the hook shank. Alright, the biot is a rusty spinner goose biot. And instead of tying it with the notch backwards towards the back and making it a smooth body, we're going to make a ribbed body with the biot. So we're going to have the notch facing forward on the fly when we tie it in here. Make a nice smooth underbody. With a little bit of a taper. Okay, now wrapping it, you want to keep the notch facing forward. Next I'm going to take a, a brown hen cape feather here. I'm 
and then a little bit of a the tip on there that I'll tie in. Palmer hackle forward. Next we're going to go back to our feather, partridge feather. The partridge will be tied a little bit longer than the hen hackle was. And that's two wraps. Any fibers you find to be too short or too long that you want to take off. Let's trim them. And there's our finished red quill variation. Thanks for watching everybody.